I'm Dr. Nathan Williams, and I'm here in our local outdoors to talk to you about rock science. We're standing on hundreds of years of New York um, history here, and it's geological history. And it's just, this sedimentary rock, this beautiful, beautiful sedimentary rock, has been uplifted just for our study. And we are very thankful for that. And we're, today we're going to analyze some of these bands, and we're going to look very closely at what we, and see what we can um, find. I'd like you to take a moment and think. Each one of these lines on this rock displays millions of years. Each one stacked one on top of the other, displaying a timeline of the human Earth. Wow. That's pretty incredible. It is, isn't it? Every three feet of rock layers is about 10,000 years of geological history. You can see important events of our Earth. Orange streaks. Now what does that tell us? Okay, they are almost even perpendicular to these layers. Now, that could imply an igneous intrusion. That could even imply an igneous intrusion of mainly iron that could have oxidized. Oh. This is not spray paint. Wow. Oh my god. Yeah. And igneous intrusions usually happen when there's a dinosaur around. Oh, man. Notice how this rock is above the ground. Usually when you think of rocks, they're under the ground. See, this is what we like to call uplift. The forces of the Earth have brought this up so we can see it here today. Dr. Nate, a crucial find. Oh, my God. Could be a fossil. Do you know what... Oh boy, would you like, look at this? It looks like the tailbone of a platosaurus. See, let's get it to the lab. Wow! Yeah, that's a platosaurus. Oh my god. I just gave myself a tap. The forces that created this sedimentary rock were very powerful. This most likely was at the bottom of a prehistoric ocean. And the pressure then was very great. You to imagine this entire area underneath an ocean, a very shallow ocean. Wow. Screen shaping manure. This is God shaping, in shaping Earth's new geological. I'll say, I'll say, yes, bring God. This is our lab technician, William Streisker. Some insightful All information. All these rocks covered by sea life teeming with fish and turtles. Imagine the animals and fish traveling throughout the <laughs> in nooks and crannies. Sometimes in rocks you can get cleavage or fracture, like right there. <laughs> I'd like you to take a moment and think. Each one of these rock layers is a million- There's a dog! <laughs> hey, puppy. Hey! And I want you to remember, this is our planet, and it's not here forever.